Right, let's get a check on the weather now with Louise Lear. And it's a, it's a busy weekend ahead. How's the weather looking? Tale of two halves, I think, Victoria, is probably the best description this weekend. Saturday looks likely to be perhaps the worst of the day. A lot of cloud around, certainly, and there will be some rain potentially developing through the afternoon. But Sunday, look at this, a much better day, drier, but on the chilly side, I suspect. Now, today, we've actually been very lucky indeed. We've had quite a lot of cloud and rain across the country, some of it really heavy across Wales. But this little window of brightness continued across the southeast, just a few isolated showers, and that's going to be the the story actually as we can push through the evening so one or two showers dotted around nothing very significant the wind starting to fall light and temperatures will fall away i suspect anywhere north of the thames let's say up into hertfordshire buckinghamshire maybe essex as well a little cooler than the night just past lows down to around three or four degrees but it'll start off dry maybe a little bit of sunshine if we're lucky a few showers this really is the starter the main course arrives later on in the day you can see behind me the brighter colors denoting the intensity of the rainfall so by the middle of the afternoon we could see some wet and windy weather returning 12 to 14 degrees ahead of it and there's still a level of uncertainty as to the timing of that rain so keep watching the forecast for tomorrow particularly if you're heading off to many of the organized firework displays through the evening there's still plenty of them close towards the capital not a great picture, is it, really? There could be some rain around. Even once the heavy rain clears away, it'll be a little on the drizzly side as well. But as we move towards Sunday, things will improve. Our weather front pushes off into the North Sea. The isobars open up, which basically means the winds will fall light. And actually, under clearer skies, temperatures will fall away through Sunday night. But Sunday actually will be a promising day. Lots of sunshine around, very nice indeed. Yes, the risk of a few showers to the south of the Thames. But if you're heading off to Remembrance Sunday services, you can't ask for better than this. Light winds, highs of 11 degrees. And if you're going to the Cenotaph, it looks as though it's going to be a similar story. Enjoy your weekend, whatever you're doing, Victoria. Sounds lovely. Thanks very much indeed.